What's going on everyone? Thank you again for coming back with me, Addicted to Life, on some more GTA 5 Casino DLC car releases. Today we're looking at the newest car that dropped in the GTA 5, the Zeruso, for $1.925 million. And then we'll go ahead and back out right here, and she is right here. I already changed her color, she's my crew bright purple. And then I also noticed, so if you do your secondary, the rims change. And yes, those are custom stock rims again. So, and there's a five, five spoke there. So, huh, not going to change them. Stock tires. But yeah, the secondary color will change the rim paint there. Uh, some things to note out here real quick. Uh, the appears to be based off the Zeruno. I uh, hope I said that right. The taillights are based off of the Bugatti Devo. The... Rear diffuser as well as the engine cover are possibly derived from the Aventador Lamborghini and the bonnet may be based off of the Lamborghini Huracan Super. So, without further ado, let's go ahead and get this customized. What are you after? Armor 50,000, brakes 35,000, oh god, I'm about to say exhaust engine 33,5. Uh, exhaust, sorry, got a few here. We got the split exhaust. Alright, wow. One, two, three, four, five. There's ten exhausts in the stock exhaust right there. Wow. Uh, okay. Oh, never mind. This one is. I'm retarded. Okay, ten. So, angular exhaust. That, whole, that changes the whole back! What? Wow, okay. Um, carbon angular. d -SAM exhaust? I kind of like the original. That. And, okay. And then the... What? The street setup. Wow. Don't bother getting a plate if you get that, because you lose your plate. That's crazy. Um, I kind of like this one. I like the original bumper on there. This makes it, I guess, more cleaner, but this looks... I, I like it, because it goes up into the bumper there, or the back end. So we're going to go with this one. Uh, front bumpers, we just have four there, so we have the open. So this is stock with the sides there. Open, open two... Okay, so we lose the splitter in the front. Open two, racing, and racing twos. So it adds canards, and you get the splitter back. Well, now, let's go ahead and do it. Grill, there's only two options, the capped and the open. Is there two pieces back here? There's not even an open one back there. Um... Why not? Let's do the open one. Hood, there's only three options. We got the clean, the streamline, and the streamline two. Let's go with the streamline two. Do you need a drink? Horn, um, we'll just go cap horn. Lights, so we go xenons. Looks like, oh, I thought they were the same for a second. Livery, we'll come back to that. Plate, uh, I'll just make it the Yeti plate, but we'll go black and yellow. Uh, respray, roof, carbon roof. I could put a roof on it. That's interesting, but you can't. The stock roof, there is no roof carbon, you see, can't put paint color on. I'm gonna leave it off for now. Spoiler: We have the primary ducktail. Okay, so there's the spoiler. Now it almost looks like it has a self-rising spoiler there. But here's the ducktail, the carbon, the drag wing. No rush at all. Huge GT wing. Secondary GT wing. Um. So if you notice the traction goes all the way up. I'm wondering if that wing comes up in the back. Because it looks like there's one there. Um, I'm going to leave it off for now. I'll go outside. If it doesn't, I'll put one on. We got the race transmission. Turbo 50,000. Okay. Wheels. I'm not going to change these again. Because uh, the stock wheel there. Smoke will just make them crew color purple. Uh, obviously not design. Windows. Can we... You can't tint them out. Interesting. Um... We'll just leave a none. Alright, that was a fast setup. I want to show you guys here, so... Good respray, and then secondary, if you change you your it. wheel there. I can do it. That just shows you can change the color of the wheel, see? 
Maybe you see better from metallic. Let's go metallic. It's changing, but I put it crew color purple so you can see it really bright there. Crew if you had one to go right there. Uh, okay, let's do livery. And we got the tricolor, which is in the middle there. I did put a diamond blue pearlescent on here for now. We have the black stripe, the flow racing. Originally, I thought this looked really good, but I'm not sure how I feel about it now. Got the zero gas, the hinterland camo, the lucky plucker, how many you got in this garage again? the Pegasus. That's pretty cool, I guess. Not too bad. You got the Ron, Ron station gas. All right, you got the rim paint. This doesn't look bad either. Um, 25,000 rim paint, so it says, for a great finish, make it a rim job. <laughs> I actually kind of like that. Uh, not, not the, the quote necessarily, Life but delivery. Uh, Flint tools and ear. Looks like there's fur on your car. It's very interesting. So, I'm either going to do a rim paint or um, is it a Pegasus? Pegasus is pretty simple. That might be the only two I like. This one doesn't look too bad if you had a... I had a black car originally before I put the purple on, but um, I think I'm going to go with that rim paint. This looks pretty cool, though. Looks very interesting. Never seen a furry livery on a GTA 5 car. Uh, or anything. Yeah, let's just go with the rim paint one. Why not? And that's going to be it, so let's take her outside and see if that spoiler comes up, and if not, we'll take her back in and put a fancy spoiler on it. I'm always here. Alright, looks like nothing actually comes up for that spoiler, so let's take her in real quick and we'll get the spoiler back on there. She does excel very fast, so that's a plus. What can I help you with? All right, something I want to check out real quick, um, because in previous cars, if you change the roof, delivery came with it. Nope, nothing goes with it. All right. So never mind. Um, and then spoiler. Let's put a spoiler on here. So we got the primary ducktail, the carbon ducktail, the drag wing. Oof, I wish that livery carried up on there. We got the GT wing and the secondary wing. Oh, kind of want to put this on there. Let's do it. Let's just put it on there. It's way. God. You know what? No. Let's just do the primary ducktail. All right. Let's take her back out, wait till morning, and I'll see you guys then. See you next time. Alright guys, we are back outside and taking her around town for a little bit. She actually handles very well. It kind of reminds me of the Krieger, to be honest. But, uh, let's see if what doors open up here. And all of them but the engine. Or, no, I guess that would be the trunk. Engine's in the back, so the trunk doesn't open up. Let's uh, look if anything changes in the interior. Okay, so your stitching, I get, I'm guessing that's the primary, could be the secondary, so whatever. You have to look, you don't really pay attention to that, because nothing changed in the interior when we are customization, so that's pretty cool. Um, there's a the big engine in the back. And, um, yeah, let's get in the doors, or get in, get in the car, and take her out for a test drive. That was a loud thump. She used to take off very good. She, I mean, she turns really good. Looks like a coordinating's a little tight. I was just thinking there was no suspension uh, lowering on this car. 
Which, I mean, she does sit pretty low anyway, so I guess that's fine. Yeah, she definitely gets up and goes. Oh no! That's how you ruin your car, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, but yeah, with that being said, I think I'm gonna let you guys off here. And I guess it's gonna be a short video because there was literally no customization. But I will see you guys in the next video. Hope you guys have a good one. Peace.